Listen up, guitar players. You must learn these scales. Now, I'm not talking about hopping on the bathroom scale and weighing in at 69.666 pounds. Don't get it twisted. This isn't about snake scales. I'm talking about the notes that connect an octave. Before we get started, you're gonna to wanna to sign up for my free music theory email newsletter. Free tabs, tips, and tricks from me. You can also snag my music theory course below. It's revolutionary. And if you wanna go really deep, sign your soul away to me on Patreon. That's all my tabs, courses, backing tracks, and a direct line to me. Much as I hate to admit it, the major scale is the best place to start. Despite its depressingly optimistic and happy tone, it's the foundation of all Western music. The E major scale is spelled E, F sharp, G sharp, A, B, C sharp, and D sharp. Now here's the formula I want to burn into your brain. Whole step, whole step, half step, whole step, whole step, whole step, half step. Using that secret code, you can build a major scale on any note. Good news, since the major scale is lame, I'm gonna be teaching you the minor scale. All you have to do to the major scale to make it minor is flat the third, sixth, and seventh scale degrees. The E minor scale is spelled E, F sharp, G, A, B, C, and D. D stands for, damn, this is so much cooler than the major scale. <laughs> the formula for the minor scale is whole step, half step, whole step, whole step, half step, whole step, whole step. Before most guitarists even play 69 notes on the G string, they learn the minor pentatonic scale. Everyone uses this. Kirk Hammett of Metallica, Dave Mustaine, James Hetfield, Dimebag Daryl, here are the five magical notes. E, G, A, B, and D. Sad but true, but most guitar players just learn the first position pentatonic box and fail to learn it all across the fretboard. Don't do that or I'll come find you. <laughs> if you're into classical music, it's crucial that you learn the harmonic minor scale. This pleases Lord Bach. All you have to do to a regular minor scale to make it harmonic minor is raise the seventh degree. The E harmonic minor scale is E, F sharp, G, A, B, C, and D sharp. That's the raised seventh. The harmonic minor scale is easily one of my favorite all-time scales. It creates some of the most erotic slash exotic sounds. Juice up your jazz chops with the melodic minor scale. Here's how it works. Just take the harmonic minor scale and raise not just the seventh degree, but also the sixth degree. Melodic minor scale is spelled E, F sharp, G, A, B, C sharp, and D sharp. You can hear the scale in action in the iconic James Bond theme. I like my WAP juice shaken, not stirred. I'm going to be totally honest with you. Everything I've said thus far is completely worthless unless you understand my three keys to extract music from scales. Pedal tones, chords, and the C word, counterpoint. Without utilizing these three keys, you're just gonna make Babe's ears bleed. To demonstrate this, let's use David Gilmore's favorite mode, the Dorian mode. The E Dorian mode is spelled E, F sharp, G, A, B, C sharp, and D. Play the scale against the high E open string. This creates a continuous tonal reference point. Without it, your ears simply won't absorb the unique character of these tones. Secondly, it's absolutely critical that you learn the primary chords of a given scale. For Dorian, it is E minor, 
and A. Emphasize each of the sensitive pitches in these chords if you really want to sound Dorian. For example, the raised sixth degree sets Dorian apart from other minor scales. Number three, the C word counterpoint. Now, what is counterpoint? Well, counterpoint is simply the study of melody. It's the science of how voices move. Try playing the exercise on the screen to help you become aware of the sensitive target pitches you want to focus on in Dorian. The C word counterpoint is one of those things you must master if you want to become a composer. And it's also an integral part of becoming a riff lord. Now I've become quite parched with all this talk of the C word. So I'm gonna go drain the Wappian C's and hydrate my internal organs with 69 grams of protein per sip. Be sure to sign up for my free music theory email newsletter for free tabs, tips, and tricks from me, Mega Shred.